Welcome to the video lecture on flip-flops and latches. In this video, we'll see the differences between flip-flops and latches. Basically, both flip-flops and latches are called as storage devices. So now I say flip-flop is a bistable device, which is which is used to store either a zero or one. Hence the name bistable. It stores either a zero or one at a time. And coming to latches, latch is also a bistable device. So this is also a bistable device and which is again used to store either a zero or one. Hence the name bistable. And coming to flip flops, flip flops change their states only during a given clock signal. This is this is how we represent a clock input. So let me draw the same thing, the clock signal. In case of flip-flops, we have control over the operation. I mean, say for example, say for example, when we change the input, the output will not change immediately as long as the clock is not given. So in flip-flops, clock controls the entire operation. Whereas in case of latches, they change their states as soon as the inputs are changed. Here we do not have any control over the operation and hence there is no clock signal given. And coming back to flip-flops, depending on when the output changes its state, we have two types of flip-flops. If the flip-flop changes its state at this edge, that means from low to high edge or at this edge, that means from high to low edge, we have, we have got something called as edge triggered flip-flops. So we call it as edge triggered flip-flops. And say for example, if the flip-flop changes its state at this period, so I'm writing the same thing at this period. So we have got something called as pulse triggered flip-flops. So we call them as pulse triggered flip-flops. And coming to latches, here we have got gated latches. So I'm writing the same thing. We have got gated latches. These are special types of latches wherein we have control over the operation. Previously, I said we do not have any control over the operation in case of latches. But still, if we wish to have such a control and that to not using a clock, then we can go for gated latches. These gated latches use a special control signal known as enable. The latch gets activated whenever the enable signal is given, otherwise the latch is deactivated. And we should remember that clock and enable are not same, both are different. And if I could state few examples for flip-flops, they are D flip-flop, T flip-flop, S R flip flop, J K flip flop, and so on. And if I could state few examples for latches, they are D latch, T latch, S R latch, J K latch, and so on. 